Good morning, guys. Welcome to the channel, OG Outdoors. If you're new, my name's Ben. I'm out here today, I got to, got to do some box blading. I guess you saw I got the disc off, got the box blade put on. I got to do some work on my driveway. The area I was where I burnt the brush pile in the last video, it's all rutted up pretty bad. I want to get that leveled up some. I want to get a place where I can start putting some pallets down. Hopefully get the pallets down today so I can get some, hopefully start stacking firewood right in the near future. But the main thing I want to talk about today was some, some boots. I got a pair of, they come from a company called High C. They contacted me a couple months ago and wanted to know if I wanted to try a pair of their boots. So I thought I'm gonna wear them, I'm gonna get them out and try them out. They came, they were, they were packaged really nice. They, each boot was wrapped up individually. They had a pair of extra laces in the box. I was really impressed with the packaging. I thought, well, they look good, so let's try them on. So I put them on. Day one, I wore them all day, not an issue. I insist on having steel toes boots around here and they're hard to find. I, I occasionally find a pair I can wear, but most of them, you know, you can tell you got on steel toed shoes. Well, like I said, I put these on day one. They're very comfortable and not an issue. I wore them all day. I even, I wear them like to the, I, you can see here, I'm wearing them to the grocery store. We were delivering firewood, so I wore my steel toed shoes for that reason, but went to the grocery store, just wherever. They're, they're kind of, they're quickly becoming my go-to shoe. I'm wearing them just about doing everything. I put the pool in and I was had to dig an electrical wire. I had them on that day. I was jumping, digging with a shovel, about a 70 foot trench. No problems with that. So I'm really liking these things. So we're gonna we're gonna do get some work done today. And I'm gonna tell you some more about them later on as we go. I'm there's gonna be a I got a discount code. I'm gonna leave you that in the description box and some other things. But stick around with me today. We're gonna have some fun. I think this will work. I've got it smoothed off pretty good. Some of the roots and trash drug off and I, I can't really go. There's a couple of stumps. I pulled some of them out. There's a bunch back behind me. I've got to rent me a stump grinder or maybe buy one for the tractor. I don't know. If y'all have any suggestions on a stump grinder, possibly for a three point hitch on a tractor, let me know. Leave me some comments, but we're going to go some pallets right now. We're going to lay a row down right here in front of this stump. I'll show you some more in a minute. Let's get those pallets. We'll get the ranger. Get that out and we'll be stacking wood here soon. This is probably the first thing I've done today that justifies me actually wearing steel toe boots but since these are so comfortable i just wear them all the time because i never know what i'm going to get into like so far now i've just been driving the tractor and there's really no need for that walking around but you know they're comfortable so why not wear them that way you're, you're covered it kills me because people will show up here to load firewood and they'll bring kids you know the kids all the kids need to learn how to work i agree they need to learn how to work but no they don't need to load firewood with sandals and flip-flops on they're like oh they'll be fine i'm like well 
Okay, I've, I've said my piece. You do it, do your thing. It's on you. That should be enough to get us started. I could probably go toward the, that way more, but I've got a few trees here I still got to cut. I want to save some room for that. They may not get cut till who knows this fall. It's it's done got hot out here. But I'm gonna try to run at an angle of these pallets through here. I'll probably cut me a couple T posts here, and I can get the most distance with my stack here. That's the good thing about pallets, because I've used these had wood stacked on them before, but you can recycle them. They, you can usually get at least two years, maybe more. It just depends on how the quality of the pallet. Looks pretty good. We'll get a few more and we'll start stacking some wood. So you saw me put the fence post in the ground. I used my sledgehammer. I think it's an eight pound sledgehammer. So what if my sledgehammer wants to slip out of my hands? Guess that works. Let's go a little higher. Make it a real test. Right here. See where it hit.
Well, I guess we're going to have to wrap this one up. Looks like that weatherman was right. It's thundering off in the distance. It's clouding up and the wind's picking up. We've got the new log yard. It's looking good. And I got logs back here already, but this is the first firewood I've actually got back here. So it still needs a lot of work. Stumps ground and a lot of ground leveling, but we'll get to that eventually. But I've got room to put a lot of firewood back here as it is right now. But if you're in a market for some boots, don't forget to check out HISEA, H-I-S-E-A. I'll leave a link in the description box. Also, I'll put a link in the pinned comment, and there's also a discount code of it's OGA. Go ahead and if you go out to their website and check them out, they've got a lot of good stuff. They've got women's boots, kids' boots, they've got waders, they've got all kinds of stuff. I can't really complain about these steel-toed shoes any whatsoever. I've had them for about a month. I've worn them doing everything. You've seen me in action with them, and they're very comfortable. I can wear them all day, so I'm not going to promote them if I don't like them. I, I get asked to promote products a lot of times and I don't you know I don't agree with the product or it's nothing useful I think or it's just not not a good fit for me I'm, I'm not gonna promote it but anyway if you like my videos go ahead and give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel hit that notification icon so you know when I put out new videos I'm gonna get out of here before the rain gets here so I'm gonna catch you on the next one and I really appreciate you watching thanks